My ministers will work to implement new regimes for fisheries, agriculture and trade, seizing the opportunities that arise from leaving the European Union. An immigration bill ending free movement will lay the foundation for a fair, modern and global immigration system. My government remains committed to ensuring that resident European citizens who have built their lives in and contributed so much to the United Kingdom have the right to remain. The bill will include measures that reinforce this commitment. Steps will be taken to provide certainty, stability and new opportunities for the financial services and legal sectors. My government's new economic plan will be underpinned by a responsible fiscal strategy, investing in economic growth while maintaining the sustainability of the public finances. Measures will be brought forward to support and strengthen the National Health Service, its workforce and resources, enabling it to deliver the highest quality care. New laws will be taken forward to help implement the National Health Service's long-term plan in England and to establish an independent body to investigate serious health care incidents. My government will bring forward proposals to reform adult social care in England to ensure dignity in old age. My ministers will continue work to reform the Mental Health Act to improve respect for and care of those receiving treatment. My government is committed to addressing violent crime and to strengthening public confidence in the criminal justice system. New sentencing laws will see that the most serious offenders spend longer in custody to reflect better the severity of their crimes. Measures will be introduced to improve the justice system's response to foreign national offenders. My government will work to improve safety and security in prisons and to strengthen the rehabilitation of offenders. Proposals will be brought forward to ensure that victims receive the support they need and the justice they deserve. Laws will be introduced to ensure that the parole system recognizes the pain to victims and their families caused by offenders refusing to disclose information relating to their crimes. A new duty will be placed on public sector bodies, ensuring they work together to address serious violence. Police officers will be provided with the protections they need to keep the population safe. They will also be awarded the power to arrest individuals who are wanted by trusted international partners. My government will bring forward measures to protect individuals, families and their homes. Legislation will transform the approach of the justice system and other agencies to victims of domestic abuse and minimize the impact of divorce, particularly on children. My ministers will continue to develop proposals to improve internet safety and will bring forward laws to implement new building safety standards. 